Hi, ma'am. This is Jeff. This is Jeff with She Wildlife and Pest Control. I just wanted to verify, I, as I'm putting it in, no, I just need a north or a south on her house. There's two different addresses. Okay, perfect. All right, I'll head to that one then. And what's her name? Karen Carter. Okay. Understood. I'm on my way. Okay. We have a friend of a friend calling for possible rattlesnake inside of a home. Uh, really exciting stuff. It is nine o'clock at night, so who knows what is going on. We're headed there now, and we shall see. Hello. Hi, Karen. Hello. Yeah. Hey, Karen. This is Jeff with Shoe Wildlife and Pest Control. I, I hear that you have a snake. Uh -huh. Okay. Where are you? I'm, Where are you? I'm on my way. I'm on Powers and South Carefree. I just need to know if you are south or north with your address. Uh, uh, Sioux Circle North. Sioux Circle North. Okay. Well, I will see you in less yeah, than 10 it, minutes. It, it, it goes on the top step coming up to my basement. And so I got my dog's walk back to the bedroom. And I'm standing up front of the driveway freezing cold. Okay. Um, just, it's, I don't know if it's a rattler because I just heard it kissing it like a rattler. Okay, well, I'm less than 10 minutes away, so I will see you in less than 10 minutes. Are you on your way? I'm on, I'm, yep, I'm on my way now. I'm on uh, Powers and Constitution, so I'll see you in less than 10 minutes. Okay, I'll see you in a moment. You're welcome, man. Bye-bye. As you heard, we have a very nervous uh, homeowner. Uh, she said hissing, so either we have a bull snake or we do have a rattlesnake. She's worried that it is a rattlesnake, of course. Uh, if it's a rattlesnake, then we, we have to make sure that we're very, very careful, of course. Uh, any snakes, I don't want bitten by any, but we don't have anti-venom with us on the vehicle, so we want, to, we want to make sure that we are very, very safe and keeping our feet, fingers, etc., away from <laughs> the the one end we don't want to be close to. So anyway, very very uh, calm is the way that we need to be. If I'm bitten, uh, first first thought in my mind right now is freaking out. But I do know that doing that, uh, it's going to run the poison rather. It's going to run through that venom right through my system much much quicker. So the calmer I can become, uh, anyway, lowering my heart rate, that will definitely help to uh, slow that venom process through my system. Chills. <laughs> hissing it right rattle and I was watching a big um, a, a, a concert movie video so it's on the top stair just right the top stair to the basement. Okay. I don't know where it is now. Let me get a few things that I need. <laughs> I'm going to have you explain that to me again. So as I go through the front of your house, yeah. the front door, which way do I need to go from there? As soon as you go in the door, okay. if you go immediate right, you're going on the hall. But you go two more steps, and there's stairs going down the stairs, and it's right, it was right, right on the top step. Okay, so immediately, the immediately in, the, in the door there. Copy that. It was small, and it was brown, but it might have rattled, and it hissed. And I had a, I had a phone up to my ear, and there was a concert on TV and I went, oh my god, what was that? And then I looked at it, oh. I understand. You guarantee you get it though, right? I'm, I'm going to see what I can do. As long as it's there, I'll be able to get it for you. Well, I it may it probably moved by now. I don't know. Oh my god. Hello? Oh my god. <laughs> Find us a snake. Over here, and I'm outside, and I'm freezing. I can't go back in my own house, and I don't know if it's still there. It's on the top step, coming up to the basement. Right, like, right, one more step. You know, like, would have been right by my feet, on my socks. And I gotta go back in the house and follow it and see if I find it. Okay, but if you speak to my dog, I gotta see if the dogs are back. I gotta see if they see me. Hold on, or right, let me call you back. Okay? okay. Is it there? No, ma'am. Oh, no. Oh, she 
mites come large and small, you know, right? Of course, yeah. They, they're born small and then they Yeah, grow, I know. They grow. I know, I don't need to ask stupid questions. I'm no, 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 no don't. Hysterical right now. No question is a stupid question. You should know that. Is there anything downstairs? Anybody? All kinds of junk, yeah. It's like But the dogs are all upstairs? Yeah, they're locked back in my in the bedroom. Okay. Fun part is I'm colorblind, so I have to go extra slow. Yeah, it's like a two-tone light, light, light brown and dark brown, and those bags were just I was bringing them up to go to Goodwill. Okay. But hey, maybe it crawled in them too. I don't know. No, I'll check. I don't know. Or if it came upstairs because it was right, like right. It was literally on this. Yeah, thing. it was right, like okay. there. Okay. <laughs> I understand. Oh my God. Their defensive mechanism, of course, is... That was just on one side of this gate, and it was there, and I, it was... I believe you. It sounded like, you know, like a plastic bag rattling. Okay. Which maybe it was because it had come up over that plastic bag. Or it had rattled or it hit. Dealing with snakes, of course, we're talking uh, any crevice, um, and especially when we're dealing with all the debris down here. Um, I haven't seen anything move just yet, but I also have uh, areas behind the stairs that are concerning because of holes upstairs in the carpet area. Stand watch your feet. Snake. I'll take him out. Karen, we're coming out with a snake. Found it. Yeah. No? Yes? Oh. I want to make sure this is him. Please come here. Oh, oh, oh. Right from a distance. Yeah, of course. Do you have him caged? I've got him trapped. He can't get you. Okay, not close, I gotta see from far. Oh. By your TV room. Oh. Does that look like he's about it? Oh, yeah! Ah. Okay, okay, ah. we're gone. What is it? It's a bull snake. Oh. You got it? <clears throat> Behind your TV. Behind my TV? Correct. snake is their defensive mechanism is the uh, the rattle 
they act like they rattle, so they actually hiss at you like she was saying, so that was correct. So she did, she heard exactly what she said. And there you go. Late night ball snake. One thing with snakes too, and we'll, once we, we drop him off somewhere I can show you. Um, but underneath, if you don't know if a snake is poisonous, now here in Colorado it's a little different, but if you don't know the snake's poisonous, where the, the anus would be, the lines are actually going to change direction on a poisonous snake. The non-venomous, which I'll show you here shortly, um, the body lines are going to go head to toe and they're going to stay the exact same direction all the way down for non-venomous. Kind of a neat little, neat little trick we've learned. <clears throat> hey, Karen. Yeah? Uh, Karen, correct me, your friend that I was talking to. Yeah. I promised her that I, since I was out in town, I'm going to start this. It's Sharon. Okay. Hey, Sharon, Ooh. it's Joe. <laughs> I appreciate that. I appreciate that, man. Yeah, and, and I'm getting ready to, uh, once I'm done with my paperwork, I'm going to talk to Karen here about some options that we can come up with to uh, ensure that she's got no future snakes. Um, you know, it's it's possible. I, I have I can't run a business with mothballs, so I can't uh, I can't verify that or or say it's not. <laughs> but to be honest with you, I don't know anybody that I can say that uses mothballs usually has an issue still. All right, guys, uh, very successful. We've got uh, Brandon behind the camera with uh, an extra good eye. He was able to find our bull snake. Uh, behind the gal's TV stand uh, and that's a confirm that's a bull snake she said that it was hissing at her and that's exactly what they do the bull snake uh, will simulate or simulate the rattlesnake so they'll flip the tail back and forth without a rattle but they'll sit there with their tongue and hiss making it sound like a rattle um, so that's that we've got uh, one snake down and hopefully we've got a homeowner now that can uh, let those those nerves calm down a bit and get some sleep with the bull snakes is they actually eat rattlesnakes so they're definitely nice to have around not just rattlesnakes though but they'll help with all the other rodents um, and again these guys here will grow up to three feet or I'm sorry six feet six feet long so you can see as I'm pulling him apart he's a good oh dang three feet right about so as I was going to show you as you look at my right hand there you can see how all of the lines underneath the very tip of the tail, his anus is right above my finger, that all the way to the tip of the tail, those lines are going to go the exact same direction on a non-lethal snake. On a lethal snake, where my finger is by the anus, the direction of those lines are going to change. So, nice fat belly, so he might have a, he's got something right here, maybe a mouse. He's got a nice tight belly though. Just.